I don't have these two gauges hooked up yet, but I do have the temp gauge hooked up and the factory oil pressure gauge works. Fuel gauge works, speedometer does not work, the automatic choke works, as you can see. Uh, that temperature gauge does not work. I don't know if that works or not. Never paid attention. It does charge. I put a voltmeter on it. Runs good. And it's a driver. Like I said, I drive it everywhere. It's plated and insured, so. Nothing keeping you from driving them. cold the automatic choke wants to keep it idled up a little bit until it warms up. Waiting on traffic. Very very bumpy road. Good old Sullivan. It's not as loud as it sounds. It is pretty loud. Uh, dual exhaust. It's got uh, glass packs on it. No exhaust leak. So. All these taxes I have that, that road like that. I <laughs> wish they would maybe redo the road, but it's hard to give it a good test drive when it's like driving through a damn cornfield. You get the idea. It's a running and driving truck. It's never left me stranded. The brakes are actually fantastic now. <laughs> it didn't want to stop when I first got it. I converted over to power brakes. doesn't really pull when you're hitting the brakes either. It stops straight. It's converted to, I don't know if it's factory disc brakes on the front, I'm pretty sure it's converted over to disc brakes. I think it probably had drums on it back in the day because, uh, well, it had the uh, manual master cylinder on it. And it wasn't the type of master cylinder that's supposed to be hooked up to disc brakes. I converted all that over, I'll show you. It's idled up a little bit high because of the choke. There. Hit the gas a couple times, it'll idle down. <laughs> There's a brake conversion kit I was talking about, but good old engine, runs good, got a new battery in it, need to tighten that fan belt, but, yep, I like it, it's pretty reliable, by the way, them tires, uh, <laughs> Should have got a shot of all the gauges and stuff while it's running, but it's got good oil pressure. Don't overheat. At least never overheated for me. Uh, doors work. It's got a sunroof. The tires that's on it, I would like to keep those. I got other tires to put on it. The rims go with it, but the tires, uh, I want to keep those tires because they're four brand new ones and they're a little too big for that truck anyway. So the tires that's in the picture 
that I uploaded to Facebook on this post are the tires that go with it.